my name is Becky. And we are the Star Girls. And today we are doing some 80s retro pastel inspired decor and party decor. And we will tell you why we decided to go 80s at the end of this video. But first, let's jump in on how to make a vinyl record bowl. Start by gathering some vinyl records. We got this one from the thrift store. You also need a small oven safe bowl, an oven safe mug to raise up the bowl, and a baking tray. We didn't have one, so we're using a muffin tin, no judgments. Place the mug on the tray, add the bowl on top, and then center the record on the top of the bowl. Preheat your oven to 200 degrees Fahrenheit, and then place the tray inside. Leave it for five minutes. When the time's up, you should see the record starting to droop. Carefully take the tray out of the oven, flip the record bowl upside down, and place it in a slightly larger bowl to set the shape. With some oven gloves on, you can gently bend the record to create some nice folds. Once the record is cooled, take it out and your bowl is finished. Remember there is a small hole in the bottom, so don't put anything too small in your bowl. Next up, we're gonna show you how to take some of your favorite 80s tech that you can find at the thrift store and turn it into an awesome succulent display. All right, so to make this, start by choosing a piece of 80s tech. We found this typewriter and an old phone at our local thrift store for real cheap. Next is the hardest part of the DIY, taking out the guts. Cut a hole or multiple holes in your tech to make a nice little space that you'll be able to put your real or faux succulents in. Get out your tools and have at it, but be careful. Next, you'll wanna spray paint your piece a color of your choice. Once it's all dry, we took some of the plastic drop cloth and cut a small piece to fit inside of our typewriter. We then simply hot glued it along the inside edge. In comes our succulents of choice, and we carefully repotted them onto our typewriter. You can use a paintbrush to get the soil out of any small nooks and crannies. Depending on the size of your plants and the size of the hole in your tech, this might not be the best long-term place for your plants. If you want something more permanent, you can try going the faux route. For this version, we also cut out plastic in the bottom. We then fill the insides with sand and stuck in some faux succulents that you can get from a craft store or a dollar store. We had to trim the stems because they were too long, but that's easy to do with some wire cutters. And that's it. Honestly, we love the vibes of this 80s upcycled tech. And lastly, we're gonna to throw together a cassette centerpiece. To make this cassette centerpiece, gather a pile of old cassette tapes. We spray painted them with a bunch of 80s colors. We also picked up this pack of amazingly 80 beads from the craft store. In a large vase, pour some of the beads into the bottom, and then stack the cassettes on top of each other in whatever order you'd like to fill the vase. And that's it, your awesome 80s decor is complete. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed those DIYs. Now, if you're wondering why we chose to go 80s, that's because the theme of this year's booby ball is let's get physical 80s, 90s style. Now, if you don't know what booby ball is, it's a party thrown by Rethink Breast Cancer all across Canada every year, and it's in support and to raise money and awareness for the breast cancer cause. Yeah, and we went last year, we had so much fun. Honestly, it is such a fun, like interactive party. And um, this year we decided to volunteer as some, on the decor committee. So this is totally decor inspired for the booby ball and you'll probably see it at the booby ball. And you also might see some familiar faces. If you would like to come or learn more about the cause in general, click the link below to get tickets. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like it, make sure you give it a like. And if you love, make sure you sub it. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.